Hi everyone, welcome back again to my channel. My name is Barry Uju and I am an open-minded Christian who loves to react to Islamic videos. Today I'll be reacting to a viral video someone sent to me of um, a cat on Imam's body. I know that cats don't like very loud sound. I know how loud the Azan can be. For me to witness this, it's a miracle. I don't know what to expect, but yeah, let's check this video out. If you're new here, ensure you subscribe to my channel to get more of my videos. Let's go. The video of an imam from Algeria showing a heartwarming moment with a cat that climbed on him during Tarawee prayers in Ramadan has gone viral across various social media platforms. Despite the cat's interruption, Sheikh Walid Masas continued with his recitation without breaking his concentration. The clip has been widely shared by numerous media outlets including Al Jazeera, TRT World, CNN, BBC, Sky News, Reuters, NDTV, among others. Both Muslims and non-Muslims alike have praised the Imam for his kind treatment of the cat. Now, let's hear what Dr. Zakir Naik has to say regarding the behavior of Muslims toward animals and the value of being gentle to them in Islam. Many people have misconception that just because the Quran says that the flesh of khanzir, the flesh of pig is haram, or the, or the hadith which says that the dog should not be kept in the, could not be allowed to enter in the house because the saliva is najis. So they think that being kind to animals also is not permitted. It's totally wrong. Our beloved Prophet always said you have to be kind to the animals. And there is a very famous hadith which all of us know that once a lady had imprisoned and chained the cat and did not treat it kindly. Otherwise she was a pious lady and Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala put her in hell. Though she was pious, she used to pray, but she ill-treated the cat and chained the cat. Because of that ill treatment, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala put her in the hell. And there's another hadith where we know that once there was a lady who was not of good character and uh, she does zina, but once she sees a thirsty dog and she gives water to a thirsty dog, because of that act, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala forgives all sin and puts her in Jannah. So showing kindness to animal is recommended in Islam. Wow, you guys, I am so thrilled by this video. Like, I did not expect it. The mom was so comported. How was he able to do that? Personally, I don't like cats. Like, if I was in his shoes, I'm sure I'm going to jump out of whatever I'm doing. Like, I will not even be patient enough to continue the prayer. Ah! Well, this is this is so, like, I learned a lot from this video. Regardless, once you are in the mood of prayer, you need to step out and, you know, pray, continue praying. Whatsoever that happens, whenever you're praying, is just the will of God. Just continue, continue praying. And this is great, guys. This is so great. Let me hear your thoughts in the comment section. How did you actually feel the first time you saw this video? Like, this is how I feel. Oh. <laughs> I'm telling you, wow. I'm short of words. Like, I, can't, I cannot even imagine. And I'm glad I saw this video. Thank you guys so much for recommending that I watch this video. Keep your recommendations coming because I'll be glad to check all the videos out. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you want to see more of my videos. And I will definitely see you all in my next one.